Okay, we ain't doing so well. I really wish I knew where her gun was. I think we're gonna have to go without it. Our boss battle is over anyways. Hey, Wayland. Yeah, ma. You're all right. Good luck, Silverman. <laughs> Yeah, he is pretty nice. Lies before you. Link to it. Insert yourself. Then search for me on the other side. Okay. Connect to Mikoshi. I don't trust this at all. I wish I could just throw a grenade at it. Then again, we would die without her help. So here we go. Come on, just a few feet. Not the time to be passing out. Here we go, let's see what happens here. Something's happening. Putting ourselves in the water to cool off. Oh, what? Is this in the past? We were reliving a memory here? Hello? This seems like us reliving something. Oh, what? A necklace? We've seen that necklace before. I forget, I forget who owned it. If that was Jackie or uh, Johnny or whoever. Once out of nature, I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing. But such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make. She's gonna make a body for herself? Gold enameling. To keep a drowsy emperor awake. Or set upon a golden bow to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium. Um, I'm of okay. Past or passing or to come. Can you speak English instead? She's trying to say that she's going to make not take a body for from somebody else. She's going to make her own physical body. Got like a a pyramid here that she's living in. It's pretty nice. Up we go. That skip ahead thing is still on the screen. I don't I don't want that there. Hello. Who is this? Oh, it's V. Looks like I was right again. Told you I'd handle it. Good to see you too, Johnny. You see any of what went down? Nope. That's probably for the best. Oh, you're running through me. <laughs> Rogue's dead. Smasher was there. I'm sorry. Shouldn't be. Died for me, not for you. Is my body still in one piece? Parked it in Arasaka Tower's basement, plugged it into the network. Figured as much. Your output's been torturing my brain with Soul Killer for a good while now. Alt, gonna show yourself. 
Say hi, maybe? Yeah, where's she at? I'm an engram now. A construct. Fuck. Yeah, well, welcome to the club. <laughs> hey, Alt, you here? Told me she's finishing the check sum. Then she'll copy me back over into my flesh. Soul killer. We can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties in pain right now. Digital analgesia. Or data streams. Certain sensations, inputs can be blocked. Blah, blah, blah. Yada, yada. Alt, make you suffer through an exhaustive lecture. Imparted it instantly. Whatever. She did say That's she convenient. was Koshi, just as you agreed. Gonna release all those poor bastards, only to suck them into her own bosom. Make them part of herself. Is that what she's gonna do to us, though? So, we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now. No. Hmm? What the? Alt? There you are. I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. For fuck's sake, Alt. You had one job and you fucked it up? I could not know the situation before conducting a thorough and precise diagnosis. You promised this poor little shit a new life! And you lie! You fucking lie! Johnny, shut it for two seconds, will you? Gotta think. Alt, come on. There's gotta be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. Is Johnny gonna have to take control and, and then V is gonna become the engram? All changes were made to accommodate you. Hang on. Telling your ex to kick me out of my own body? I knew this would happen. The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs. But while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Hmm. Oh, to give us a what the hell for? Is he gonna trick me into a green? Giving you a free pass, even though he can already do what you want with No, because I don't trust her. You're my friend, Lee. I'd never pull that on you. Never do you wrong. Enough. Honestly, talk in circles till the goddamn sun implodes. But I told you once already and haven't changed my mind. Still got a life to live. So you should go. If you're not ready to die, then you're gonna live. Johnny. So what do I do, Alt? Simply cross the bridge. You will become a part of me, as V's body and former life are restored. Hmm. Cross the bridge and enter cyberspace forever, or enter the will to return to V's body? Enter the well. I'd like to return his body, but I think he's just gonna die anyways. But maybe if we become, uh, if Johnny becomes part of alt, he can somehow live that way. I just don't think that it makes sense for us to take over V's Johnny. body. Don't make this any harder, eh? Just don't forget I came around. I won't. Ever. Off we go. Become part of the the Borg Collective or whatever the heck this is.
Yeah, I said I trusted Johnny, and the Johnny that I trust, that's what he would do. We're going through all the colors. But now what? V is still in a body that's dying, so it can even live. Now, even with Johnny gone? Or not? Are we somehow fine? Like, what's going on here? Did our pals somehow get us out of there into safety? That seems unlikely. Like, what's, what's going on here? Or is this, like, some time later? Yeah, how did we get such a nice place? What is what is what is this? Talking about Johnny. Good morning, v. I trust you had a restful night. Mm -hmm. You have no new messages. You have one meeting planned today at the afterlife. Delamain has confirmed a vehicle arrival at the arranged time. Okay, cool. I your calendar is empty for what remains of the month. Would you like me to begin planning? No, thanks. That's as it should be. Okay, yeah, he is dying. So he have just nice spends day. all of his money on. Okay, that's why it showed all of our money going away, because we bought all this crap. Hey, boss. Hey, you there yet? Not yet. It'll be on time, though. His people came to scan the place earlier. Check and make sure everything's clean before he arrived. Huh. Thought we didn't notice him. And the gear? All set <laughs> with the heat. Rest, too. Full tank, ready to launch. Ready to launch. Be there soon. What are they talking about? Uh, let me put on my clothes. Wait, I can't? Okay, there we go. Whatever we're doing, we shouldn't be doing it with no clothes on, probably. And we got no weapons. I assume it's gonna be over here. Wait, take my jacket? Is it Johnny's jacket or something? Or is that gonna come later? Coffee? No, we didn't need to make coffee. Well, I guess we finally made it in life, at least for a short amount of time. Where is this AV that I'm supposed to be waiting for? Is it gonna arrive or... Do I actually need to go here and skip time? Does that actually do something? Okay, it's, it's later. <laughs> I didn't see the help. Okay, maybe I need to make coffee? Not sure what's happening here. Okay, maybe in here? Messages? Okay, I'm in Meet at the La Afterlife. Mr. Green's birthday, blah, blah, blah. 
We are running out of time for obvious reasons. A decision, please, if only because my patience is wearing thin. So V, what will it be? I will I be pleasantly surprised or disappointed once again? I don't know what that's talking about. Grabbed an orbital air tanker. What? Okay, I don't know what that's all about. Okay, we've got a gun. Nice. Oh, we've got a lot of guns here. Why? Why do we have so many guns? Uh, Alright, well, I guess we'll equip those. I don't know if we're going to need them at this point, though. Oops. We'll equip the assault rifle. And... A submachine gun, I guess, and a pistol? We have no attachments. Okay, cool. Oh, here's where we wait. Or maybe not? Is that not it? Hmm. No, that's not it. Okay, I'm really confused as what to do. I'll get back to you guys when I actually figure out how to wait for this AV. Oh, here's Johnny's jacket. Cool. Alright, so let's uh, equip that. There we go. Perfect. Oh, and there's the AV. That's weird. Okay, so I thought getting the jacket was an optional thing. It's not. That's what we needed to do for the AV for, to actually wait for the AV. Very confusing. Good All right. V. Hey, Del. Are you prepared for takeoff? Yep. The afterlife. Head over there. Your wish is my command. My, don't you look tired? Did you have a difficult night? Difficult few weeks. Success weighing you down. Is that it? I was under the impression you had gotten all you wanted. That you'd shown the city exactly who is top dog. Can I help? I'd very much like to help you. I don't think you can help me with anything. Mood in the city. What's it like? Arasaka's problems continue to compound. Organizational disintegration? Its share prices collapsed? Public mistrust is at an all-time high. I could go on. That makes the sense. Your soul was to be a smashing success for Arasaka. It turned into a horrific curse. They lost all resources related to the program. Mm -hmm. Promised the rich immortality. Sold them on it. Actually collected engrams and knowledge. A bit for control. For power, I say. And well, now story. Alt has all that, right? It was about that you've taken on something rather big. And that one with great power and even greater funds is backing you. Nothing much. Oh, is all helping us with all this? Chaos, striving to restore even a semblance of order. It seems you, the afterlife, are safe for now. Good to know. May I ask you something, V? Shoot. You mentioned recently that only one thing matters to you: to gaze upon Night City from the very top. I hope your deep learning covered metaphor. You're not about to tell me to exercise caution when looking out the window. Sarcasm. Funny. No. I wish to ask what will come next once you've achieved your aim. Well, that's it. That's his only. That's his only thing that he wanted to do. While I understand your meaning, I can't seem to imagine that. If there's anything I can do to help you avoid that fate, please do tell me. Might be I'm beyond help. Anybody's. But that's okay. It's more than okay. I've chosen the optimal route. We'll be arriving shortly. One last thing before I shut up as requested. Don't worry, V. Don't worry? About what? 
It's good that Arasaka's having problems. I mean, we didn't help out uh, Hanako, so she and her brother are probably going at it and causing all sorts of trouble within the company. Best of luck, V. May your plans bear succulent fruit. Internal strife is... It's a good thing for people who don't want Arasaka to succeed. We'll probably be back, though. I doubt that's the end of them. Another murder outside your bedroom window? But what if you could leave all that behind? Far, far behind when you begin your journey to the final frontier. Send the word space to 729. Is this what we're doing? For a chance to win a one week getaway for two at the Crystal Palace. Ten casinos, five pools, top end brain dance equipment, and the best chefs in the universe. If you're looking for a taste of paradise, don't wait a microsecond longer. Send space to 7299 right now. I'm actually able I'm actually able to do that. No, I don't think I am. The Crystal Palace. Feel alive in the dead of space. Is that somewhere we're actually gonna go? I feel like it might be. Why is it so white? What? Is that normal? What? What? Okay, I don't know if that was normal. But regardless, we're here. Boss. Boss. Hey, we good? Perfect. Your box is ready and waiting. Okay, so we took over the afterlife for Rogue after she died. Okay. I was wondering what was going to happen to this place. Get you something? Nothing for me, thanks. I understand. It's the big day, isn't it? You're meeting him? Meeting who? Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhand's preferred. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. You know what she said? Said it was about remembering. Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. So, I'm gonna knock one back. You're healthy, and to the mission. Alrighty. Good luck, V. Good luck? Why do I need good luck? What mission are we doing? Hey, boss. V. I've long awaited this moment. Mr. B. That's the person we were talking to in the messages. Legend in the eye. I must say, I'm moved. Happy not to disappoint. Sit, sit. Okay. Talk to me. Well, V, Rikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you eddies. Influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up. My people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's hmm. all systems go for the op. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Oh, so it's just another mission where we're messing up Arasaka? Won't be disappointed. Pick the best merc around for the job. So I've heard. But I'd like it proved to me as well. Speaking of which, nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. Well, we're already burning up. Guess that's why you hired me. <laughs> You know why I hired you? Because you'd do anything at all for even the faintest chance at survival. Even if it meant coming to within a hair's breadth of your untimely death. True, but is this a chance for survival for us? This time tomorrow, should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Crystal Palace. 
Is that the ticket to there? So yeah, we are going to be going there if we successfully complete this mission and not die. Wait, so we did complete the mission and now we're going. That's what's happening here. Right. In position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. Hmm. Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. One shot only for what? Something I don't know. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. What are we doing here? Taking over the space station? Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Then again, who am I to judge? Alright, let's get armed. We only got one pistol, that's all we took with us. I mean, I guess that's all we need. Uh, can I take out my weapon? It doesn't look like it. Alright. I don't think I can go through there. Alright, seems like that's it. I'm enjoying this, uh, what seems to be like a little epilogue to the story. Because I, I kind of expected the game would end when <clears throat> we made that big decision of whether or not Johnny would, uh, would go with Alt across the bridge or take over his body. But we're getting a lot here to finish things off, and I like that. Okay. Here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. Okay. Here we go. Into space. Oh, cutscene? Wow, this is new. A third person cutscene for ourselves. They've got to notice us coming though, right? There's no way we could be that stealthy. It might take a while at that speed. Sure, you don't want to push off a little bit harder than that. <clears throat> Will that even work in space? I feel like it won't. Unless there's also oxygen inside the cartridge or something. We not get to see if he succeeds in his mission or not. I guess it doesn't matter too much. <laughs> All right, what are we loading into here? Oh, yep. Hey V, what's up, kid? Been a while since you came to see old Vic. I bet your tunes in the afterlife found you a new major league ripper, huh? Swanky downtown fucker shooting crow out his ass. Am I right? Is this us going and meeting all these people again after get, what happened? Get all you can out of this life. You deserve it. More than anyone I know. But stop by sometime, okay? Next time you're in the neighborhood, we'll talk about old times and I'll take a look at you. Make oh, sure this is like a video message that he sent us. Screw anything up. See you around.
Oh, is that the only? Me oh no, there you go. Yeah, we're getting more messages. Hey, B. I was just wondering how you've been. Haven't heard from you in a while. Still living large in Night City. I don't know. All I think about is dropping everything and leaving. <laughs> Yet here I am still. Well, the city's like quicksand. The more you try to get out. Once you're up to your knees, you're never getting out. Like, like Evelyn. Yeah, things did not turn out well for her. Anyway, look out for yourself, okay? And call me sometime. Bye. Now, when were these recorded, though? Were they before we went up there, or Maybe. are we actually? Do we actually succeed? Me? The one with the car. <laughs> the one with the car. Listen. You wouldn't happen to have any gigs to spare, would you? I'm not picky or anything. I'll take whatever pays the rent. If you've got something, or if you know someone who does, give me a call, okay? I'd really appreciate it. So, yeah, um, that's it. Catch you sometime in the afterlife, maybe. Hello, B. Saul speaking. From the Elder Caldos. Um, I heard some big noise. I only vaguely I remember say, him. With, uh, you involved. No idea what that was all about. But, um, if you're ever in trouble, and need a hand or a place to disappear, we're here. Well, he's nice. You've saved an Alda Caldo's life. And we will never forget that. It's a debt we're happy to owe. Stay in touch, me. Yeah, we'll stay in touch. I just, I don't I don't hey, fully remember me. you. Sorry. It's me, Mitch. Remember? You saved my ass from Kang Tao. Nope, don't remember him either. Well, doesn't matter if you don't remember, cause, cause I do. Anyway, if you ever need help with anything, I got your back. All right? You just give me a call, and I'm in Night City before you know it. Doesn't matter if you want someone to disappear or if you need lunch brought to your office. Literally anything. All right. All right. Take care now. It feels like V maybe is is dying is gonna die here because these are all the people who are so, just. Here's the thing. It's all the people who are our friends. Fifth precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron, sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Showing how important Order V was. Up or to blow it all to the ground. It's all these people. Maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff. I still remember what you did for us, for me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. I want to make sure they're equipped. Yeah, River's a nice guy. Me. See you around. Oh, this hey, guy. V? Jefferson Peral is here. You know, mayor of Night City. I'm calling about our recent program to tackle homelessness. What would you say about being the head of my security detail, huh? As you know, the number of people I can trust are few and far between. Next week, we're going to be raising the city's taxes. So, things might get a little hairy. Come by, we'll hammer out a good deal for you. I'm no any pincher when it comes to safety. You probably shouldn't say that we'll over at least just a video message. They'll probably keep that stuff uh, confidential. Although, I guess he trusts us at this point. Hey, v. each other for so long and I well one thing led to another know what I drew strength the Emperor and the world babe the world's gonna hear about you go and show Night City what you're made of interesting all right is that is that all of them Okay, we're getting music now, so I'm assuming that's all of the video messages. So that was interesting. There was a bunch of people basically showing us how important that v, v was to all sorts of people. He rescued people, he helped people out, people want to help him out. Because they're all doing that, I feel like... I felt like maybe V was going to die there and not succeed at the mission. And 
uh, that would just be show him how how worthwhile his life was already that he made an impact on all these people's lives um, but then that last message where she said she pulled strength the emperor and the world does that mean that we are gonna survive and we're gonna be better than ever and we're gonna really make it to the top I don't really know or maybe we're just gonna make a huge impact by succeeding at this mission but then still dying and maybe that's uh, our our name is gonna be known around the around the world but we're not going to be there to hear about it. Uh, we'll see once these credits end what actually ends up happening. Oh, and here we are, back at the main menu. Okay, I, I, I actually didn't want to do that. It's, it gave me a, a prompt where I could choose to, to get you from my last checkpoint. Let me see what that actually does. So it said something special would be waiting. Let's figure out. Oh. Yeah, tell me something I don't. Oh, it just it just takes me here. Okay, I bet if I loaded a different auto save, it would it would show me, but it's fine. I'm sure it wasn't uh, too important. Well, all right. So that's uh, that's Cyberpunk 2077. Now, of course, that game had some problems. It was a bit glitchy at times. Uh, the story was actually a little bit shorter than I expected. The main story, that is. So uh, there was so much lingo in it also that it was really hard to understand what was going on sometimes. Although maybe that was just a, a problem uh, that only I faced. But overall, it was a really good game. I liked the world, how expansive it was. I liked the story a lot. The story was great. The, I, I was enjoyed the characters. They all felt three-dimensional. They never felt like they were... They were, they were complex, like Johnny, for example. Uh, Johnny, he started out one way, he had character development, and the way he ended up at the end was very different from the way he w was in his original life. And the same thing happened to V, and the same thing happened to a lot of characters. So that's one thing I really like about this game is the, the progression that all the different characters went through. But yeah, I'd say the best thing about this game is the environment, the world, the characters. Uh, the characters especially. I think they did a really good job on it. Uh, I, I think uh, despite all the negativity around this game, it's a game worth getting, a game worth playing. Um, I'm sure there was a lot more gameplay that I, that I missed by not doing any of the side gigs or side story type stuff. And I'm okay with that. I enjoyed the main story most of all. Glad we uh, were able to see it through to the end there. Now, things at the end turned out pretty similar to what I was expecting, where Alt, it, well, it turned out that only one of us, or that Alt really just wanted Johnny to live, but it actually wasn't that simple. It seemed like she actually did give Johnny the choice. I was expecting her to not give us a choice. Like she would be the big bad in the end and she would uh, forcibly take over V's body and put Johnny in it or something like that. That wasn't what happened at all, uh, and we got so. Alt was actually surprisingly nice, um, although of course she did just absorb a bunch of people's engrams and become powerful off it or something like that. I, I'm really curious what happened to her. That's what I really wanted to know in the epilogue. Like, what happened to her? Uh, is she the one that helped us get to the heights that we were at in the epilogue? There, I wasn't really clear on that. Did she become some sort of self-aware AI? Well, I mean, she's already was a self-aware AI, AI, but did she get like some sort of physical body, or did she, did she take over more of the, of the crazy internet system that they have going on? I have no idea, and I'm a bit sad that we didn't get to learn what happened to her. I am a bit sad that we never ended up getting enough skill points to actually craft legendary weapons. Uh, in fact, there was a lot of different high level skills that we just never unlocked because we never got enough levels or skill points. I'm a little surprised at that, that we managed to get to the end of the game without maxing out a single skill tree on any of them, even though I focused pretty hard on specific trees. So that's a bit interesting. I wonder how many side missions and gigs I would have had to go through to actually fully max out our character. It seems to imply that there's a lot that is still remaining to be done in this game which is pretty nice but i think we're fine 
I think I'm fine with my playthrough, how it went so far. I'm glad we went and did Johnny stuff. He's an, a, such an important character. I'm glad we were able to give him some freedom. And then, especially since I decided to have him stay behind and go be consumed by the void. So yeah, I, I think I'm, I'm glad with how, how everything turned out. It was a great game. That's about all I got to say. So thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.